download the decryption. So, what's on there? It's the entire blueprint for reflection. For everything. And it's way too complex to be just an upgraded grid link or something. Okay. Can you call Noah? Sure. Plastic and Faith. Good to see you safe. What's the beat? Plastic decrypted the drive. It contains the complete blueprint for reflection. Can I keep the drive? I want to study the blueprint. You can keep it for now. See you soon, Faith. Shut up, Kuma. to your senses. That is if it happens before Kruger catches up to you. Faith, you've grown. Barely out of prison and already stirring things up. <laughs> your parents would be proud. They were talking about Elysium, whatever it was you stole from there. Who 
was that? Rebecca Thane. The leader of Black November. She knew my parents. Yeah, we were all part of the same group before. Anyway, Rebecca was always a breed apart. She thinks she can change the world by blowing it up. Faith, she wanted the Omnistad drive. The blueprint on it. Why not give it to her? Because in her own way, she's as dangerous as Gabriel Kruger. Reflection's obviously more than the conglomerate will admit, and I have a feeling Rebecca should be kept away from it. Good, because I was gonna offer it to Dogen. I tell you well, didn't I? Not to take sides. I do take sides. Our side. See ya. Faith. What? Never mind. I'll see you soon. just as well. The data is watermarked anyway. Even I couldn't get rid of that. Dogen acquired a restaurant while you were gone. Gastrofusion. It said he spends most of his time there these days. And supposedly it's all the rage with the high caste. Imagine the crimes are of glass as a cook. I'd be careful about eating his food. Rumor has it he's got most of the family seating out of his hand by now. Pirandello, 
you should humble me with a visit. I'm sorry, I should have come sooner. Far be it from me to judge. It's not like you owe me anything. Look, about that, I've got something to square my debt with. Don't be crude. I haven't seen you in two years, and already you're talking about debt. Come. Machines make perfect food. But perfection is boring. It's the imperfections that truly make something unique. And so I like to occasionally introduce a human touch. A little imperfection. You still have it. I thought... I'd get rid of it. I almost did. You made me very angry, Faith. One could almost say it's your specialty, considering the extent to which you've recently aggrieved Mr. Kruger. He is out for runner blood. Whatever it is you stole from him must be very valuable. It's the blueprint for reflection. Ah, then you have it with you. Not right now, but... Then we will discuss your debt when you do. In the meantime, I believe a show of good faith is in order. Pardon the pun. Anansi have been remiss with their payments. A little human touch should set them straight. All right, I get it. What do you need? Go to the Anansi Emporium. I will update you along the way. Safe to go high with your own proper tools. I like your little something in the storage room. It should help you reach the top of Anansi.
A suitable task, don't you think? Yeah, very subtle. How about the item we have for you? It should be more than enough. I will investigate the potential value of your proposition. But first things first. Just remember Faith. Dogen looks to himself first. Ah, that hurts, Noah. And it's also not true. Almost there, Dogen. Excellent. Go to the top. Release the tuned mass damper, and we're good. For now. The tuned what? A giant counterweight intended to make the building safe for earthquakes and hurricanes. But not for me. It will be our instrument of destruction. Does the Nazi really deserve this? Are you having second thoughts, V? The Nazi's not exactly a force for good. Every day, low-cast are dying in the Greyland factories. Producing toothpicks and diapers for the midcast here in the city. Do this for them. And not for me. Thank <laughs> you. 